We got married in June and it was truly just me, Andy, and our minister and it was the best decision I think we could have made. It was kind of last minute, we didn't tell our parents until literally like the day before. We didn't tell anyone but I wouldn't trade it for the world. I think, I think about like our first wedding I guess you could say. I like vividly remember saying our vows to each other. And I don't think that we would have gotten that opportunity. So I am so, so glad that we got to just, you know, be alone and have that moment. probably his sense of humor and his kind heart. There's nothing that he doesn't mean or like when he says something he's just so genuine and pure in everything that he says and does but he's also really really funny <laughs> once you just get the opportunity to kind of know his heart. So, uh, she's so, she's got a pure heart, she's so authentic, she doesn't really sugarcoat anything, but uh, she's just the girl I've, you know, always loved. You know, even in the tough and the good, she's just uh, the person I need in my life, and, and we're a great team, so. I love everything about her. We took a leap of faith, I don't know, 10 years ago, and decided to move to Texas. You always envision your daughter, you know, growing up, being the princess she is, and you have a plan, but <laughs> Texas wasn't in it. <laughs> what, a, what a blessing um, Kelsey has found in Andy and uh, in Texas. 
I see the happiness in Andy's face and uh, the happiness in Kelsey's face. She's got a heart of gold. And uh, again, I'm just so blessed and so lucky. And you want your, always want your daughter to grow up and uh, find her Prince Charming, and she did. So with that, I want to say congratulations. And uh, let's party and have a great, great night and celebrate this couple. Congregation, I present to you, Mr. and Mrs. Andy Ryan.